Hi, I'm Danielle Smith and welcome to your weekly calendar where I share the events and activities in your community. So listen up and take notes, here we go. Don't miss your chance to join the Northeast Oakland Historical Society for the Oxford Cemetery Walking Tour, Stories of Old Oxford, this Saturday, October 6th. Hear from the past to understand the present as you experience community members dressed in costume, relaying the stories of prominent figures in Oxford history that helped shape the town to what it is now. Guests will meet at the Northeast Oakland Historical Museum, located at 1 North Washington from 1 to 4 p.m. For ticket information, contact the Northeast Oakland Historical Museum at 248-628-8413. Do you have any hazardous materials that you are not sure how to dispose of? If so, Oakland County has you covered. Come out to the Oakland County Service Center campus on October 12th to properly dispose of any hazardous materials you may have. Acceptable items include old batteries, antifreeze, gardening chemicals, burnt out light bulbs, paint cans, and broken electronics. This type of waste can be toxic to humans, dangerous to your home, and harmful to the environment. So use this opportunity to dispose of the hazardous materials in a safe way. For a full list of acceptable items, how to transport the materials, and to register, go to oxfordtownship.net and click on the environmental tab. The Oakland County Service Center campus is located at 1200 North Telegraph Road in Pontiac. Oxford Township Parks and Recreation is hosting a Jack-O-Lantern Jamboree on Saturday, October 26th. Head over to Oakwood Lake Park located at 550 East Oakwood Road at 11 a.m. Enjoy nature trails, hay rides, cider, donuts, a pumpkin from the Great Pumpkin Patch, and candy and other tokens from Sugar Treat Trail. Guests are encouraged to come dressed in their Halloween costumes. For ticket information, visit the Oxford Parks and Rec Department located at 2795 Seymour Lake Road or call 248-628-1720. Tickets must be purchased in advance, so get yours soon. The Friends of the Oxford Public Library is holding a book sale this week from October 3rd through the 5th at the Oxford Public Library located at 530 Pontiac Street. Visit the library on Thursday, October 3rd from 10 to 7 p.m., Friday from 10 to 4 p.m., and Saturday from 10 to 3 p.m. Saturday is also $5 bag day. For more information, contact the library at 248-628-3034. The annual Scarecrow Festival is just around the corner. Come on out to Centennial Park on October 12th. Walk along Washington Street and admire the creative scarecrows that local businesses have placed outside their doors. Feel free to get in on the action yourself with your own homemade scarecrow. Enjoy different activities, games, contests, food, and live music. This is a family-friendly event where kids are encouraged to come dressed in their Halloween costumes and go trick-or-treating at local businesses. There will also be inflatables and a hay maze. We can't forget about the chili cook-off where downtown restaurants will compete to see who has the best recipe. If you are looking to get in on the scarecrow action, head over to thevillageofoxford.net and, and click on the downtown life tab to register and get a complete list of rules for the free scarecrow competition. The scarecrow festival is October 12th from 11 to 3 p.m. The Oxford Chamber of Commerce is holding their next new member orientation on October 15th from 8.30 to 9.30 a.m. Guests are invited to the Oxford Community Room, located at 22 West Burdick Street. Learn how to make the chamber work for you while getting any questions you may have answered. Topics covered include requesting ribbon cuttings, sponsorship opportunities, registering for events, and more. Do you have the inside scoop on an event you think the community should know about? If so, we want to hear from you. Contact the studio at 248-628-9658 or email us at manager at occtv.org. That's a wrap for your weekly calendar. Make sure to follow us on Facebook and YouTube to stay up to date on all things going on in your community. I'm Danielle Smith. See you next time.